Hello everyone. Today, we're delving into the world of a medication called epinephrine, commonly known by its brand names EpiPen, Adrenoclick, and AviQ. As always, this discussion is for educational purposes only. If you have health-related questions or concerns, please consult a medical professional. Description Epinephrine, also known by its generic name adrenaline, is a medication available in the form of an auto-injector. It belongs to a class of drugs known as catecholamines and is primarily used in emergencies to treat severe allergic reactions, anaphylaxis, quickly. First approved by the FDA in 1939, it remains a crucial tool in managing life-threatening allergic reactions. Epinephrine works by stimulating alpha and beta adrenergic receptors in the body, which results in several physiological responses. These include increased heart rate, improved heart function, dilation of airways to ease breathing, and constriction of blood vessels to help raise blood pressure. These effects are essential in reversing the dangerous symptoms of anaphylaxis, such as difficulty breathing, swelling of the face or throat, rapid heartbeat, and a sudden drop in blood pressure. It's important to note that epinephrine should be administered promptly at the onset of an allergic reaction and is typically used as a first-line treatment before seeking further medical attention. Individuals who have a history of severe allergic reactions or those at risk of anaphylaxis, such as those with allergies to foods, insect stings, medications, or latex, often carry epinephrine auto-injectors for immediate use in case of emergencies. Warnings while epinephrine is a life-saving medication, it's essential to use it cautiously and only as directed. It should not be used as a substitute for emergency medical care, and individuals who receive epinephrine for anaphylaxis should still seek immediate medical attention afterward. Before using epinephrine, it's crucial to inform your healthcare provider of any medical conditions, such as heart disease, high blood pressure, thyroid problems, or diabetes. Additionally, disclose any medications you are currently taking to avoid potential interactions. Before taking this medicine Before using epinephrine, it's important to familiarize yourself with its proper administration technique. Make sure you understand how to use the auto-injector correctly, as it's typically administered into the thigh muscle in emergency situations. If you're uncertain about how to use the device, ask your healthcare provider for demonstration and training. Side Effects like any medication, epinephrine can cause side effects, although they are usually temporary and mild. Common side effects may include increased heart rate, palpitations, sweating, nausea, vomiting, dizziness, anxiety, tremors, and headaches. These effects typically subside quickly after administration. In rare cases, epinephrine may cause more severe side effects such as irregular heartbeat, chest pain, difficulty breathing, severe headache, or signs of an allergic reaction to the medication itself. If you experience any of these symptoms after using epinephrine, seek immediate medical attention. Interactions Epinephrine may interact with certain medications, particularly those that affect heart function or blood pressure. It's important to inform your healthcare provider about all medications you are currently taking, including prescription drugs, over-the-counter medications, and supplements, to avoid potential interactions. Dosage the appropriate dosage of epinephrine depends on the individual's age, weight, and the severity of the allergic reaction. Typically, the standard dose for adults and children over 30 kg, approximately 66 pounds, is 0.3 mg, while the dose for children weighing between 15 kg and 30 kg, approximately 33 pounds to 66 pounds, is 0.15 mg. It's important to follow the specific instructions provided with your epinephrine auto-injector and to seek medical attention immediately after administration. FAQ Many individuals wonder about the expiration date and storage of epinephrine auto-injectors. It's crucial to check the expiration date regularly and replace the device before it expires. Epinephrine should be stored at room temperature, away from light and moisture, and should not be refrigerated or exposed to extreme heat. Closing that concludes our overview of epinephrine. Remember, this information is for educational purposes and should not replace professional medical advice. If you have any questions or concerns about epinephrine or its use, please consult your healthcare provider. Thank you for joining us today.